Hey everybody, this is my 125 gallon New World tank and I want to talk about the driftwood I put in here recently. We are going to shoot a video in the very near future talking about the future of this driftwood and whether or not it's going to stay in the tank and so on and so forth. I've been thinking a lot about it today. But I also wanted to just shoot a quick video for the beginning fish keeper, a person maybe with a little less experience in the hobby. I've been asked a lot over the years about driftwood and the white fuzz that grows on it when you put it in your tank. Now, in my experience, whenever you put driftwood in the tank that you've collected yourself out of doors, like this big piece we're looking at here that's all covered in green cyanobacteria and algae, well, that's exactly what you get when you collect a piece outdoors and you bring it home and just wash it off with the hose and maybe give it a little scrub with the scrub brush. I didn't sterilize it, boil it, put it in the oven or anything like that. It's just washed off and fresh from the outdoors. And invariably, when I put something like that in the tank, I get an explosion of green growth on it. But whenever you buy a piece of driftwood from the aquarium store, and you put it in your tank, what you'll find is that you will get a white, sort of fuzzy, filmy looking, slimy growth on it. It looks kind of fuzzy and slimy at the same time. It's really strange looking stuff. It's kind of scary looking stuff. It is absolutely harmless stuff. It's, it's some kind of fungus that grows on the driftwood and most fish will leave it alone. Some fish will eat it but ultimately, over time, it's something that will simply go away. And whether the fish eat it or not, the tank will just sort of season itself in and all those little oddities will start sort of working themselves out. And that weird, white, fuzzy uh, stuff you get developing on the driftwood will simply go away over time, whether the fish eat it or not. Uh, I know snails will eat it. If you've got any snails in the tank, they'll eat it. And again, you know, if nothing eats it, it's just no big deal. It's just a little bit of fungus that grows on new driftwood. And again, I have no idea why it grows on wood and why it only grows on wood that seems to have been um, sterilized in some fashion. But that's what it is. It's absolutely harmless. It's nothing to worry about. And in fact, there's plenty of fish out there that will use it uh, as a food source. And they'll eat it in the same way that they would eat algae. So there you go. Don't worry about the little white fuzzy stuff. And as far as if you go out to your local stream or even get some cool pieces of wood out of your backyard and you put them in your tank, you can expect to see some of that green growth. But again, we'll be talking about this particular piece of driftwood in an upcoming video. I don't necessarily think this one's going to be staying in the tank, but we'll talk about that. So thanks for watching this one. Hope that was helpful to somebody. Hope that might have relieved a little bit of stress. Don't forget this one here is my 125 gallon new world tank. I'll see you real soon in the next one.